YouTube now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that's... It'll be so fun. It's going to be fun, I'm sure. No. So what we're going to do, we're going to wait at least for two people, then we can, then we've got an audience of two. And then any more, then it's great. So just wait for Mummy to tell us. Excellent. Mummy's showing zero. But I will start in 20 seconds, maybe, Jayla. Let's do like 20 seconds. Mummy's going to be patient. 17, 16, 15. We have one. So do you know what? Let's just move along. Okay. Today we're here. We're going to do um, a review. It's going to be in two parts. You're going to do your snack. And I'm going to do a pod review. This is going to be, hold on, this is going to be one of my first pod reviews. So, I'm going into gym, and this is... Daddy Jay's Pins! So, let's get on with this. So, Jayla, you can talk to people about what snack you're going to be doing. Well, walkers. Walkers, mix-ups, spicy flavours. French fries, Doritos, what's it, and what's the money? Let me just show everybody that. Are we all good? Lovely. So, we went shopping and we found this, and we thought it was great, so it had all four of them in there. Go ahead, Jayla, let's have a little taste and tell people what your thoughts are. Is it crunchy? Is it soft? Is it spicy? Is it, what is the texture in your mouth? Talk to, talk to people out there. On the tip of my tongue and the back of my throat, um, it just does a little tingle. Mm. It's a little tingle. That's great. How is it? How's the texture in your mouth, Jayla? How is it feeling? Um, it feels like... Is it crunchy? Is it soft? It, Let's have some of those languages, Jayla. It tastes that crunchy. Yeah, it's crunchy. Which one is the most crunchiest in here? If that's a word in English. I think you're right. Sounds like one of those YouTube videos that you watch, seeing people just eating. Mind you, I watch them too, so. <laughs> I, I, I know this is what Who would you recommend um, these mix-ups for? Um, oh, the little chili warriors. Or just anybody, really. What about these? Look, it's got all these different um, types of crisps in it. It's got French fries, Doritos, what's it, and once much. So if you love all those types, this would be right up your street, wouldn't it, Jayla? Yeah. So I'm going to eat the little Dorito crumbs. There we go then, little Dorito crumbs. Nice. Mm. Lovely. They, they all have the same taste. They do. All spicy flavour. Do you know what? No, I won't have any. I'll be spoiling this. Okay, okay. That's... Jazzy J's Peach and her review on Walker's Mix-Up Spice, um, spicy flavour, little tingle on, on the tip of her tongue and the back of her throat, she says. Um, yeah, go get yourself a bag if you like all three, most definitely, yeah? But there's four. But there's four different flavours, what did I say, three? Yeah. Okay, stay corrected. Okay, everyone, so I'm going to do a pod review, and to be honest with you, I'm slightly excited about this one, because I tried to grow this this year, and I failed, and I failed miserably. So, a friend of mine called James Salter sent me um, a few pods, he sent me two um, lemon, KS lemon starbursts, KS being Kang Star, and he also sent me two um, Sugar Rush Peach, but they just went straight down very quickly and did no review. But here, the KS Lemon Starburst, everyone. Look at the phenotype of that. Hold on, Jane. Look at the phenotype on that. That is possibly the desired um, phenotype, or should I say pod, that Kang Star was... Um, looking for. It does have a tail but it's curled in on both of them. This is a cross between an MOA Scotch Bonnet and a Bohemian Goat and I know that Tanstar loves his Bohemian Goat. So here, going to look forward to this. Let me just finish this so we can have our little talk. So, I am going to be cutting this and saving the seeds. I know that Phil Blake wanted to have some of these. I have noticed some of his. Is he watching? Phil, appreciate you watching. Wifey just said. So. Can I have one? 
Oh, wow. That. Wow. That smells. You can smell the. You can smell it, sir. You can smell the Scotch bonnet. That that good old chinnings. Don't, don't get it close to your close to your mouth. Yeah, for you it will be like that. So I'm just gonna say the smell, the smell Jayla, is phenomenal. So this has got a good number of seeds. What I will do, I'm gonna separate them. I'll dry them. And for anybody who is wanting them, just send me a little message and I'll see what I can do. These are extremely fresh. What I can do is maybe send five out to five out in a little package to as many people as I can. I'm only gonna keep just about five. But it is. You can smell it. Hold on. You can smell it. It's very fruity. Most definitely. I would say that is a medium um, walled chili. I have seen others. Where you, if I know you won't be able to see this, but I can see the oils glistening. So, guys, chin chin. Let's see how this goes. I'm just gonna have half. I'm not sat here doing a, a challenge, am I, Jay? <laughs> very crunchy. It bursts, absolutely bursts in your mouth. Um, Look. Hold on, Jen, let me just do my talk. Hits the tip very quite instantly, and then you get a little, a little, excuse me, here we go. Here's my hiccups. You get that definite, definite fruity, chinensy flavour, and that is quite fresh. Ooh. Excuse me, guys, I don't know where these hiccups are. I thought I kind of controlled them. But this is quite nice. Do you know what? I'm going to go out and be greedy. Excuse me, and have the other half. Mmm. If I'm going to describe this, it'd be fresh, fruity. Not fruity to the point where it's floral. The, the warmth in the mouth isn't isn't offensive, and excuse my hiccups, isn't offensive. This would probably go well in like some kind of jam, excuse me, in a, in a fresh salad. I quite like that a lot. Would I be growing this? Oh dear, everyone. Most definitely. I would say the heat is on par with a scotch bonnet, scotch bonnet. I've never had a bohemian goat, but slightly more aggressive on the heat than a scotch bonnet, because a scotch bonnet to me has got that nice fruity flavour. This one has that fruity flavour, but it's got more of a, a stinging punch to it. And maybe that comes, excuse me, maybe that comes from the bohemian goat. But guys, if you ever have a chance to grow one of these, or maybe even Collect get a few seeds from me. I am more than happy to be handing these out. And I know that Pan Star doesn't sell these. He he um is very charitable, hold on, and he hands these out himself. So um there is the desired Fino. If it had a tail, it'd probably be even more desirable, but there it is, guys. Love that. Been looking forward to this for two years to be honest with Jayla. Yeah. So oh wow. Yes, now thank you. Well, I think I'm alright. But I also, well, I appreciate it. Okay everyone. The the heat is still in the mouth. This is going into gems. This is who needs to be restrained on every possible video that I do. So if you liked it, press like. If you get yourself subscribing everyone and Jodie will do the last part, what do you do? Press the bell for notifications and boom, let's get ourselves up to 1,000 subscribers and get Luciano to do something chilly crazy. Everyone, let's say bye. We can talk about what we think later. Bye. 50,000.